And welcome to a game that really should have pulses racing. Every reason to believe this will be enthralling. I'm Derek Ray. With me for commentary is Lee Dixon. And what we have to bring you is live action from the A-League. What a match this promises to be, Lee. Well, thank you, Derek. Glorious atmosphere here. Really looking forward to it. The fans are too. The players look like they're up for it. This could be end to end. We could get goals today, Derek. And this is how the hosts will begin the game today. Would you call it 4-5-1, Lee? Yeah, I really like this formation, Derek. 4-2-3-1, really. The two central midfield players supplying support to a three ahead of them and then a lone striker with a number 10 just behind him. Let's have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors. Looks as though they're going with the belt and braces approach. Yeah, 5-3-2 or 3-5-2. The midfield will be flooded when they've got the ball. Defensively, those fullbacks will be asked to supply support to their three centre-backs. But it does enable you to play two strikers up front. And the match begins. Derbyshire, Mark Milligan. Here's Benyat. And Milligan has it. Benyat. Milligan. Couldn't keep it. Cox. Nikolai Muller. Dangerous looking attack. Possession lost, intercepted. Derbyshire. And taken away. Couldn't keep the ball. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. Might take the lead. Well, that's fine goalkeeping. Real concentration. Well, he's given a corner, their referee. Now the delivery, cleared away comprehensively. Troy Isi. Well, time just challenged magnificently. Ben Yat. Tommy Orr. Playing with purpose and control. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Susaeta. Benyat. Well, they're keeping their opponents moving and guessing. They couldn't maintain possession. Oh. 
And very deftly cut out. Benyat. Might be able to produce from this position. Can they get in behind them? It's opening up for them. Cox. Torrance, James Troisi, can they take the lead here, it's neat passing, confidence on the ball, Cox, Nothing in it, Derek, is there? Just testing each other out tactically. It's fascinating. Who will buckle first? This looks promising. And he's made headway. Oh, a goal! They strike first. And what a way to silence the crowd. Well, we see it again here, and the pace and accuracy of this passing is a dream. And then the sheer power of the strike, really impressive. It's a thunderbolt. And so it is, the first half story has been written. Well, this man will get mother plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Lee. Well, his manager will be delighted with him. He's been spot on in this game, hasn't he? Energy, imagination, desire, and a steely determination. And the match begins. Fine goalkeeping, real concentration. This looks promising, and he's... As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far, and now the second half is underway. Cox. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. Troy Isi. And Graham Dorrance now. McGowan. Nikolai Müller. It might be on for them. Oh, big opportunity. And the challenge crisp and clean. And the counter looks on here. Options available. A really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Gordon. Russell. Happy just to retain the ball in their own half and draw out the opposition. Half an hour remaining then. He's given it straight to the opposition. Meredith. Tommy Orr. Derbyshire. He could pick out a teammate. It looks promising. Dangerous looking attack. 
Oh, uh. Meredith has it. Well, they continue their push for the equaliser, but definitely not forcing it. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. And they could do damage. Pivotal moment defensively. Fifteen minutes remaining. And there to intervene. Dorrance. Troy Isi. Dorrance. Well, when you can keep the ball like this, it's got to be really annoying for the opposition. There might very well be late excitement. Five minutes left and the margin just one. Gordon. Well, in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. Russell. And that is the end of the game. It goes into the history books as a home defeat. Lee, your thoughts? Well, nobody likes losing Derek, but when it's such fine margins, it makes it hard to take. Still some positives, though, and they will regroup and surely go again. And I think it's accurate to say, Lee, that this man was the light bringer for his side. Well, he's always a danger, isn't he? No more so when he grabbed that goal. He never disappoints me when I watch him. He's just too good, simple.